Hello traders, it's E with a midday report about quarter after 12 on the 15th of March 2019. Finding traders to use risk capital you can afford to lose if you're playing this game. Well, earlier today we had talked about the possibility of getting to our target at 29 and a quarter. And then don't forget that 33 and a quarter <clears throat> target that um, was begging to be hit. We've just achieved that. And again, uh, certainly not bragging. You know me, I'm pretty humble. Just pointing out the obvious that our targets have been hit. We've suggested to traders we could go higher, but for all intents and purposes right now, make sure you are covered coming into the 32 to 33 as well as obviously that 29 and a quarter. This was our target zone and, and a high odds target zone based on our work. So at this point, you have to take um, the OTF predictive chart and you have to make adjustments. And certainly we, we know that the easiest thing to do is just take the same interval we've been using and moving it up one notch. So that will be next. Um, and we have gone stem to stern this week. We've had a pretty strong week. I think most of us would have expected perhaps, okay, let's get a pullback today, but you could feel the pressure up. I would have actually preferred to see that um, because I, I don't like the risk that gets involved once we get up near these highs that were stretched so far. Uh, but measure is a measure. And we said, hey, if we cannot you know, bust the 15s to 16s, then that's, that's going to be our support. So when IB came back, and we liked the short side to come back and test for the half gap, but when we couldn't get to 16, we said, okay, we got to use that 16 support. We already had called 12 to 15 support earlier. That was intact. We said, so let's see if, uh, in fact, we can get that before the day's over. And if we're going to do it, the morning would be the best time. And then traders perhaps take some profits and cover. So that was our call. Uh, what can I say? Educated guess, but the system clearly laid out the ground rules. And we explained that with our traders today. So uh, they, they were informed this was our best chart to keep an eye on our 10-minute chart. It, it still was giving us the read that we could get up here and test this 32 to 33 plus, take out that prior high. And a reminder, this was the high that we had talked about. We felt that the boys wanted to bust that high just because they can and just to, to say, no, this is, you guys are out of your positions and should have been a long time ago. You didn't believe us. You kept thinking that this was not going to keep running. So at this point in time, <clears throat> longs are solidly in control until they aren't. And we've got targets today above this. Our primary target today is 33 and a half. And above that, the good fortune part. Our intraday chart tells us for now this 25 zone is supportive. If broken, then we can get back and test in the 23s. For now, the aggressive support, we're calling at 28. Till 28 gets busted, that's the squeeze pivot. Stretching trapped shorts. All right, hope you have a good day. Hope you have a great weekend. Happy St. Patty's Day to those of you who are breaking out early. I'll have one more video at the end of the day. Hope you had a good one.